All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Friday. We are playing Zushin. We, we are going to summon him. Zushin is going to get summoned. So we got... Okay, he's just going to go ahead and scoop. He saw my extra deck and he's going to send scoop. We're playing the Monarch Engine with the Zushin. Uh, and pretty much the way we're going to do it is uh, we need four cards. We need Wild Monster appear, Zushin himself. We need uh, Nep Nepta something. You'll see him. And then... We need uh, escalation. Yeah, so we're playing escalation. You 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 understand. You understand. Oh, my opponent scooped it up. I mean, what? You gave me a shitty deck. I'm gonna go ahead and splash it in with what I think is good. And I think the monarch engine, especially since I'm playing escal. I need to play escalation. Monarch engine. Da da. All right, get out of the door, Okay. Like I said, I don't know. I'm still debating on whether I want to go first or second with this deck. I mean, that that next card will be very viable. So you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and take the second. Ew. <laughs> oh, wow. Triple Eidos. All right. So, my ideas are fucking useless. I do triple Eidos. Like, awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Fucking, oh my god. This man's using ninjas. Like, no, no. Today is Friday, not Tuesday. Like, wow. I can't believe I drew this garbage. Uh, did you get super transformation or just transformation? Oh, just transformation. All right. Then I'm probably going to get Apex Avionde. Uh, we'll probably be doing, oh wow, yeah, and he's doing exactly what we're going to be doing on, uh, upcoming on Daily Duels this Tuesday. Pendulum Ninjas, definitely. Like, oh my god, like, this is, this is, this is bad, like, why do I draw triple Eidos in a row? Like, what the fuck? Fucking trash. Alright, turn your shit into Apex Avion, obviously. Yep. Wow, just, like, awesome. And go ahead and summon one from my deck. Oh wait, I have nothing in my deck. Like, uh, I would totally summon Karaz and start popping my own shit, but nope. I can also just scoop it up. Like, Apex Avion, open up triple Eidos. Triple Eidos? Like, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this, YGO Pro? Be our back. Wow, that, that that was probably one of the worst hands I've ever gotten with this with Monarch Engine. Like, holy shit. <laughs> anyway. Uh, we got the Escalation, Magical Mallet, we got we got a lot of plays. Uh, I was actually mistaken, I was actually mistaken. When I did the card review, I was like, oh, you can just fuck it up with Utopia Lightning. No, you can't. I was actually wrong. Uh, he doesn't activate. So, if you go after him with the Utopia Lightning, with 5,000, he'll just fuck you up and go to 6,000. Like, he ain't fucking around. Like, holy shit. Anyway, uh, we'll go ahead and just start our Monarch plays, and hopefully everything will go okay, because we need everything to go okay. Alright, we'll go ahead and play this. We'll go ahead and reveal that, uh, Karaz. And like I said, I think I'm just gonna keep drawing. Like, I'm gonna go ahead and grab me another Panditi, Pitch of the Tenacity. Like, we actually get to play Tenacity in here, because they're actually playing more than a couple of Monarchs, so... I need that Escalation, so I'm gonna hold on to that. Like, that, that Escalation. Alright, we got three out of the four cards. Just need one fucking more card. Just one fucking more card. One more card. Alright, so, uh, gotta go ahead and activate that Panditi. You know, we're doing the Escalation because, of course, I can go ahead and grab that. Um, uh, kind of want to grab... Kind of want to grab, a, like, a Domain or something. I'm only playing two Domains. I'm going to I'm gonna grab anything I can pop. I guess I can gra grab OG Monarch, set it, then summon, pop yourself, pop the OG Monarch, you know? Okay, so I'm going to reveal OG Monarch... Uh, I forgot, I had to reveal three. Uh, OG Monarch, Domain, and Escalation. Give me one of them, I don't care, because I'm going to pop it with Cross anyway. Anyway, I'm supposed to be talking about uh, part two, part two, people, of uh, how the tournament went. So I think I left off uh, my second PK fire, which I kind of sacked and did the dirty, dirty to him. And I feel bad, I felt bad, but did I feel too bad? Not really, <laughs> not really. Uh, so we'll go ahead and set that, we'll go ahead and set this, we'll go ahead and normal summon this, get an additional tribute summon, normal summon Karaz, in which Karaz will go ahead and activate his effect, pop himself, pop one of my escalations, draw me two cards. I don't plan on doing any damage to you with, uh, this. Oh, wow. Well, that sucks. That really sucks, because I needed that escalation. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So, I need that escalation. I, I definitely need that escalation. So that sucks. That sucks ass. That it was twin twisters this entire fucking time. Like, are you shitting me? Uh, I should have set the magical mallet too. I was thinking about using it, but... God, that sucks. Go ahead. Like, oh, twin twisters. Fuck up your entire plan. I would have had it. I would have had it. I had uh, Deptune. I have Nuzu Engine. I have Wild Monster appears. Like, I would have fucking had it. 
All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and activate Panditi. You're still not doing that. I want Escalation. I want, oh, I can't do anything with the rest of these cards. I cannot really. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just show you like the scariest cards and you're gonna give me like the least scary, which I think will be Escalation, right? Like, give me Escalation. Give me Escalation, please. Please, I, 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 if I get Escalation, God damn it! you gave me fucking, you gave me fucking uh, tenacity. That's not what I need at all. Uh, that's not, that's no, that's, that's not, I don't need tenacity. <laughs> I don't need none of that. If I have a Monarch card, I might just go ahead and put the tenacity back. I'll wait a turn, I'll wait a turn. Like, what the fuck, man? Like, why Twin Twister? I would've had it. I would've had the fucking plays. But no, Twin Twister, fuck up my escalation. All right, thank you. Thank you. I didn't want to fucking bust out this fucking pretty much invisible boss-ass beast monster anyway. All right, I'm thinking about putting, thinking about putting back Azushin. Yeah, I'm gonna put you two back. Because if I get lucky, I can go ahead and draw into something and then use the idea plays. So, I'm gonna put you two back. I need all of you, and I'll hold on to you. Maybe. No, I put you back too. I might get something. Yeah, I need you three though. Come on, escalation. Nope. Uh, show me potato salad. No. All right. So, uh, no. Nah. I'm just not getting any of my ethers or anything. Like anything distribute would be great. I got battle fader, so that's nice. So I can go ahead and summon battle fader, block something, and then proceed to you know do the idea. I just need ether, and ether can summon garage, pop, draw. You know, I, I can definitely drop. That's all I need to do. It's just, Wild Monster appears, summon Zushin. Escalation during his turn, summon Tyrant all over my Zushin. That's literally all I have to do. Like, wow, now I'm getting a whole bunch of Wild, uh, wild Monster appears with uh, nothing to do with them. So that's, 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 that's good. That's, that's good. So I'm just gonna go ahead and set these two. And if he has a Twin Twister again, like, I'm surprised that he's not doing anything with his death spot right now. Like, he should be all up in my ass. Like, dude, this should be game. But you, you're just kind of sitting there, just twiddling your thumbs, like, I got nothing to do with my despots. Like, that's crazy. You should, despots are fucking so strong. I knew you were going to get another Twin Twister. That's fine. That's fine. You fell for that. You hella fell for that. This is a wild monster appears in a fucking Panditi. It's exactly what I needed in the graveyard again. Like, and you're still doing nothing. Anyway, like I said, I think I was at part two, where I just kind of sacked a PK Fire player. So let's go ahead, go on to uh, five out of eight. Uh, round five, I face. Can you guess? Because I faced what? A, a noob, monarch, PK fire, PK fire. Round five, I faced PK fire. <laughs> uh, and, and you're going to see, you're definitely going to see a pat pattern here. So we'll go ahead and activate this. I guess I'll go ahead and escalation, definitely. Uh, OG and domain. Just give me the escalation, man. Ah, you gave it to me. Yes. Why would you do that? <laughs> like, ha. Ah. Like, you already know that I'm playing fucking Zishin, so. Uh, that, that's pretty good. But my opponent has to control a monster. That sucks. My opponent has to control a monster, and I don't. So my opponent has kind of fucked me by not doing anything. Like, you, you, you son of a bitch. Like, if you do not play a goddamn monster in this fucking duel, I will murder you. Like, this is this is actually getting annoying that he's not doing anything. I need you to have a monster on the field so I can play my fucking this, summon this, then tribute summon during your turn because I can't normal summon that, and then summon him. And then I will have pretty much Zushin in spirit because he will gain Zushin, Zushin's effect. And then pretty much I win unless you're playing some kind of a... Uh, of a... Uh, fucking son of a bitch! Oh my god, I hate this duel. Like, he's not doing shit right now. This is so annoying. Summon a despot and do something, you fuck. And watch him just go ahead and just like summon despot five and pop my fucking escalation. I'll be so upset. I'll be so fucking upset. Like incredibly upset. <sighs> Fine, put back two, whatever. Like you still haven't got three. Like I don't care. Summon despot one. Okay, that's fine. I don't care. Yes, finally, finally, fucking finally, we can drop this motherfucking Zushin in this damn duel. 10 minutes in, and we're finally dropping. You guys voted for him. Oh, some of you guys did. We already know about that. But it is fucking time, people. So I'm gonna go ahead and activate Bolt from the fucking blue. 
or a wild monster appears. Summon that motherfucking Zushin. It's time, people. Boom. Zushin. Can't fucking touch him. He's fucking super strong, super power. Then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, fuck up your Despot 1 because you know why? Because I can and you can't touch me and that's so great. Ah, ah, see this is, there's many, many ways. There's one version where you just keep on drawing and drawing and drawing and drawing. I was like, nah, I don't think I'll go with that version of it. So we'll go ahead and set this and then next turn, we'll go ahead and uh, flip up that Escalation of the Monarchs. Escalation. And during my opponent's main phase, escalation. I should activate it, wait until the main phase. Like, I totally forgot. Oh my god! Son of a bitch! Ah! <laughs> that was my last escalation. And then my shit goes back to my deck. Alright, 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 alright. Fuck you, man. Fuck you. Like, I'm done. I'm done. This asshole didn't let me get out shit. Popped off two of my escalations. Ghost over my other one. Like, nigga, I just. Fuck you. Fuck you. You weren't doing shit anyway. Be, be right back. Alright. Wow, that was, that was, that was real annoying, I must say. Twin Twister, one of them, fucking just pop the other one. All right, I got three out of the four cards that I need. I just need Zushin. If I get Zushin, then let's go, you know? Oh, and I need my monster, my opponent to control a monster. Okay, all right, so, this sucks. I, I have a feeling that if I set both of these, I'm gonna get Twin Twister, so I'm just gonna set one. <sighs> I got all the cards, I got all the cards. I just need my opponent to have a monster, and it is Zushin motherfucking time, like, but Ghost Ogre Snow Rabbit fucked me up. Like, I should have. I, I forgot that I can. During my opponent's main set, I thought I could activate it as soon as possible, which means that I probably fucked up when I was like, alright, let me go ahead and fucking do my uh, escalation. And then I activate it during my main phase, and it's like Ghost Ogre. It's like, oh, fuck me then. Just fuck me. <laughs> yep, I will take all of that. No, that is fine. I will take all the damage, because in the end, it will not even matter when I drop this fucking Zushin. And I'm gonna drop this fucking Zushin. Oh my god. Oh my god, really? Out of all the cards to shuffle back? Out of all the cards to- What the fuck? Why is everything stopping me from doing my fucking plays? It's so stupid. Oh my god. Ah! It's so frustrating. I just want to pull Zushin. That's all I fucking won, but no, get your shit shuffled back, bitch. Oh, thank you. I had a perfectly good idea to go ahead and shuffle back, but no, you get my fucking, like, oh my god. <laughs> this deck is so bad, like, it's not worth it. Zushin's not worth it, people. He's not worth it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I want to cry like wow. I, I had it. I had it. He had a monster. He had everything. It was solely set up. I fucking had it. I, mm, I fucking had it. Oh my god. It's so frustrating. Be right back again. Please, for the love of Christ. Anyway, I need to get started on the fucking part two. I, I'm 13 minutes in. I haven't talked about part two because I keep on getting fucked in the ass because I can't jump goddamn two shit. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway. Uh, once again, faced another PK fire, and this guy, this guy, he opened up really well. I didn't open up well at all. Uh, he ended up hoping, taking my shit, and just been really just fucking me in the ass, like long dick style. It was just terrible. Uh, I think he, I think, I believe this one's the PK fire that two owed me, and uh, yeah, he he just opened up really well, like extremely well in the duel. All right, so uh, I think I might go ahead and pitch this just to get deeper into my deck, like. I'll go ahead and pitch you, draw two. Okay, so I got two out of the four that I need, and I can go ahead and get the fourth card, which will be, I guess, fine. So we'll go ahead and do you. Uh, I guess I can go ahead and do triple tenacity and then get guaranteed get the card that I want, but right now, I mean, there's not really anything that I can do too much this turn. Not really. Yeah. I think I might go two Pandeities and a Tenacity. And then he'll give me whatever, and then I'll pitch the filth spell. And then get deeper into my deck, because it's all about getting deeper into the deck. I don't give a shit about the Monarch plays. Once I bust out that Zushin, especially with uh, Neptune, like, yeah. Like I said, there was a deck that played all the, the normal monsters and all that, and I decided, nah, you know. So he's gonna go ahead and give me that, which is fine, because I'll just go ahead and reveal Ether. 
and then get me the Pendidi, because I want pen fucking deity, and I'm just gonna keep playing, so I just need... Not that, I didn't need that, but that's, that's fine, I guess. So, I can actually do a play this turn, which is fine. So we'll go ahead and summon you, activate you, summon you, tribute you to, for you. Squire, sure. You, sure. Go ahead and get that back, and then you will go ahead and send me a Panditi and a OG Mark. And I guess I could summon... Is it up to two? It is up to two. I can have you just target yourself, pop yourself, and draw a card. That wouldn't be terrible. This card can't attack, but I don't care. Yeah. So I'll go ahead and just summon you, get you back. Then... I think Karaz misses timing. Yeah, because of... Uh, Karaz misses timing because of uh, idea. Because it says when, not if. So, ooh. Ooh, bet a lot of people didn't know about that, so. You can't attack anyway. I guess the monster that summon can't attack. Okay, so. I guess you're summoning Demok and then an attack is cut in half and I battle Demok. Like, okay, I guess. Like, I really don't care. Sure. This. <laughs> As long as I don't die, I really don't care. Where's my battle faders and shit? Like, I don't see a single battle fader. I guess I can always summon back my prime and shit, so I'm okay. Oh, and Karaz will come back to my hand. The next turn, I might be able to just go ahead and tribute summon Karaz, pop yourself, pop my reckless chain, you know. It depends. Alright, so Pitch Dark Magician Girl draw. And do all of them have that, like, you battle, you special, and do all that shit, I'm assuming? Try not to get my prime fucked up by Demok though. That would that would not be fun. No, that's fine. I'll take it. So at this point, uh, I mean, he gets he gets hope off. He takes my shit. He goes into Demok. He just fucks me up. Like, like uh, he ends up getting all of his side for me, and I end up not drawing into much, not even much revival. And now he's a butt ton of back row. Great, great. That's totally what I need. Not. All right. That's fine. No, that's fine. The draw. No, now I get Battle Fader. That's that's fantastic. And by fantastic, I mean no, that's not fantastic. <laughs> All right. So I think I might just go ahead and activate Reckless. Because if I activate Reckless and I see my next cards, I could possibly go ahead and get what I need. Let's probably go ahead and activate Pendidi first. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and activate. And deity first. And I'll probably go ahead and reveal Escalation, Escalation, and then Grudge, or Tenacity, to get Escalation. And then I'll have three out of the four cards I need to go ahead and drop the powerful Zushin. <laughs> like I said, once I get him off, alright, thank you for the Escalation. Thank you. So, uh, I, I probably won't be doing that play. So, that's fine. I'm still debating on whether I want to do this Tribute Summon play. I'm not thinking right now, no. I think I would just want to activate Reckless and see my next two cards. Because my next two cards can be very viable for this play right now. So, And they are, because I can go ahead and get Magical Mallet. So, so Magical Mallet, I'm going to go ahead and put back you, 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 you. I need you. I'll hold on to you. You, you, you. Yeah. Yeah. I need you. I'd like to hold on to you. I need you. Need you. Need you. Rest of you four can go back to the deck and I'll draw. Ah, yeah. So there we go. I actually got it. So we'll go ahead and activate Bolt from the Blue. Summon Zushin, which you can't touch, which is just power. Unless you hit me with that solemn morning, in which case I will go ahead and off myself and uh, proceed to uh, cry in a corner because I just want to summon Zushin. Let's do it. Please! <laughs> I've done so fucking much. No. Summon Zushin. Fuck. He's on the fucking field. I'm gonna kill that fucking Demok because I don't want him on the field. Actually, I could just kill this bitch. No, because then she'll summon Dark Condition Girl and I attack into her. Like I said, it really doesn't matter. It's not like Demok's doing anything. Because if I attack into her, then she'll go ahead and, uh,. So I like to target a special summon one spell cast in your grave bard. Change the attack, my attack is cut in half, so I guess it really doesn't matter. Demok's not doing anything, so. You summon Dark Magician Girl, and then uh, attack will go to Dark Magician Girl, and then I'll fuck her up! 
I fuck up all of these bitches. Sure. Because I'm unaffected by your card effect, so I'm not forced to attack Dark Nation Girl, so I'll just kill her. Because I'm motherfucking Zushin, bitch! Ah! So we'll go ahead and set that. Set that. Set that. We're bluffing. We're bluffing. We're bluffing. As long as I get this escalation off, we're good. And face Twin Twister me. And then uh, pop my fucking shit, and then I'll proceed to kill myself. Like, alright. Alright, go ahead and get a dark magic attack. Really don't care. Like, no. I don't care. Mm, still don't care. Draw phase. Standby phase. Main phase. Start a main phase. I want to act activate escalation. Yes. Nope. Should be summon. Should be summon Zushin, and I win! Because there's like no fucking way that he's gonna be able to get around this shit. Bring that ass here, boy. Neptune, gain Zushin effect. Ah, did I do it? Did I do it? We're good? Did I fucking bust out the powerful ass fucking Zushin in spirit as Neptune? Like, damn! <laughs> like, what do you do against this thing? <laughs> oh my god, it feels good to finally be able to fucking do this shit. I don't care. I don't fucking care. <laughs> I don't give a fucking care. I don't give a fuck about anything for the rest of this duel. Like, if you can find a way to get over from this guy, then you can fucking have it, you know? No, that's fine. Like, will you stop chaining and let me resolve my fucking effect already? I don't care. They said you blew my shit away, that was, they were all just bluffs. From DD, tenacity, I don't care. They were fucking bluffs. <laughs> so uh, now I am, uh, that was round five, so I'm three and two. Three and two, all right. Uh, round six, I duel against, can you guys fucking guess? PK fire, yes, PK motherfucking fire. Uh, game one, I, I believe I go two one. I end up beating him. Uh, I only, I had all the PK fires that I faced, I only lost the one. Uh, game one, he takes me with, uh, with, uh, hope. Like, F-Zero is, like, the perfect answer for Cosmos. Like, just take them Dark Destroyer, hit you up with it, you know? It's, like, really, their only answer. Uh, but no, 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 I 2 on him, I 2 on him. Because game one, I have Dark Destroyer, but I, I have the set card that saves my booty, the Cosmojo. Yes, he doesn't. He summons F-Zero, comes after me, yeah, Cosmojo, banishes F-Zero, and then pretty much he stalls out for the, for the remainder of the game. He can't summon shit. I'm a 3,000 beater, he can't target, can't fuck with, and he just ends up just scooping it up. Uh, game two, he opens up like the booty, like straight up. He opens up like ass to the point where he was like summon, uh, I think like Taka talk, talk Tomborg, and then he tried to like, uh, Smash change second it, and I was like, wait, you run like Divine Win or whatever, or or was it Kage or or whatever his name is, right? And he's like, oh wait, I thought that was Dark. I wanted to go and dank off. It's like, no. So kill Pratiji could push, kill his monsters. That's fine. Like you, you can't uh, you can't touch me. Like I pretty much win. Like I win. Good day, sir. I have summoned the Zushin. See right there, Zushin the Sleeping Giant. Like, huh? <laughs> like I said, this deck is Saki. Saki is just, just using the Monarch Engine trying to fucking bust out the Zushin. You guys said Zushin. I will summon Zushin. I have supplied the Zushin. Now, we can always do it the other way around where I just block and draw and block and draw, kind of like Exodia deck, and eventually just summon a normal monster with Moon Mirror Shield and just keep on giving it counters, uh, Magical Mallet, shuffle my shit, redraw my shit, and then just keep drawing and shit. I could do that version, so we could possibly try that next Friday. But for now, I was like, you know what? I want to try this version because I, I was like, someone suggested this with, uh, with a wild monster appears, summoning this tribute, summoning with escalation during my opponent's turn. It's just power, it's just power, man. Like you, you got nothing. You got nothing, Zega. Nothing. Like I summon Zushin. That's it. GG. You can't even go to Utopia to lightning because apparently I was wrong about that. So unless you have Monarch Storm Force or a, a fucking uh, uh, Kaiju, any shit you can do. Sure, I'm not gonna target you, fucking Master Blade. I don't give a fuck. Like, I do not give a fuck. I don't give two fucks. I don't give three fucks. Time up. You lost anyway. Like I said, you were going to lose anyway. You are going to lose anyway. Uh, I kind of feel like getting, like, one more duel. We'll try it one more time. Bear back. All right. All right. We'll try this one more time. So, draw, draw, draw. I drew one out of the four cards that I need, which is fine because I got Pendidi and, and Pantheism and all that fun shit. So, uh, is it actually tunes or are you just playing tune table, tune table, tune table. 
because it looks like you're just gonna do something sacky, which is fine because I guess I'm also doing something sacky. So tune table, tune table, tune table. You'll probably get oh, tune Gemini off. Okay, I thought maybe it's like tune blue eyes or something. No, summon tune Gemini off. Okay, play Nacro Valley. Okay, like that sucks. Cards and either play. Can I? I don't even think I can even activate Pantheism anymore with that shit. Like now, like uh, I'll try. I'll go ahead and pitch, draw, draw. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can't even activate because of fucking Necro Valley. That sucks. Holy shit, that sucks. <laughs> uh, so I can just go ahead and summon Eidos. And then tribute summon Eidos for Karaz. And I have Karaz pop. Yes, your Necro Valley and then my domain. Because I really don't need domain. Like, it's just another monarch card if I need it. Like, I don't want to allow you to another draw, but... I guess it's better than allowing fucking Necro Valley to sit down the field and fuck me up, so we'll each draw a card. It's breaking rule number one and rule number two of Yu-Gi-Oh, but, uh, I'm gonna have to do it. Because I need to go ahead and continue my searching. We're gonna go ahead and, uh... Uh... I don't want none of these cards, actually. Yeah, I don't want none of these cards. Give me that. Give me that. And then give me that. Huh. <sighs> so, yeah, I just fuck him up. Game game two, uh, he, he eventually goes into uh, Dankwall. Alright, that's fine. So, I'm gonna go ahead and activate Magical Mallet. Take the Neg. I hate that I Neg on Magical Mallet, but it's helpful to play. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I, I drew into nothing. So, I got two out of the four cards that I need. I can't attack. So... I should probably go ahead and set this because he's gonna pick a card out of my hand, like, and that wouldn't be great. Hopefully, he picks out the cross. He's gonna hit me directly and pick a card out of my hand. Like that sucks. I can't even attack with cross, of course. He like cannot uh, attack during a card. This card is normal summon or special summon. So, soon Jim Nyop is gonna hit me directly. I'm probably gonna end up losing something. Oh, and he got breaker, motherfucking breaker. Like, all right. Alright, pop my wild monster appears. Alright, well, there goes one of my cards. Oh my god. How? It's so obscure. Like, I'm literally getting fucked up by obscure shit. Like, you would have told me that Breaker was gonna summon and pop my shit. Like, alright, 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 alright. Alright, yeah, I'll go to Utopia, Utopia to Lightning. No, just Utopia. Wow, am I actually gonna get fucked up by a fucking scrub? Like, wow. It's fine. God damn it. I didn't, I, thought, I seriously thought he was gonna use that Tomb Gemini Elf, like, I thought you were gonna hit me directly and pick something out of my hand. If I'd known you weren't gonna do that, I wouldn't have set the fucking wild monster up here, so I would have kept that in my hand. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucks. I still got nothing. Oh, this sucks. Oh, this sucks. Where's idea? Where's anything? <laughs> wow. Just, just fuck me. Like, this deck, this deck is not going well for me at all. And get another Necro Valley? Oh my god. Fuck me. Just fuck me. I'm gonna get beat by a fucking scrub. Like, oh my god. I'm gonna get beat by a fucking newbie scrub. Because I can't draw into shit. Like, please, let me just draw into a fucking Monarch Speller Trap. Like, I don't care. Like, please, let me just draw into it so I can activate Pantheism. No, I draw into fucking Battle Fader. Okay, still can't do shit. Like, oh my god. And there's Necro Valley, as soon as I can, once again can't do Pantheism. Oh my god, fuck me. How am I getting fucked up by all these obscure shit? I just want to summon goddamn Zushin. No, I'm gonna battle phase that. Yep, I'll battle phase it, and then next turn I can tribute Karaz. And I can have Karaz once again pop your Necro Valley, pop my Pantheism. If I need be, if need be. Holy shit, I might just have Cross pop himself. Reckless, I didn't need that. So I'm gonna tribute someone and have Cross pop himself in the Necro Valley. Draw a card and then hopefully fucking draw into what I need. Because if not, then just fuck me. Just breaking fucking rule number one and rule number two of goddamn Yu-Gi-Oh. Never mind. Get hit with Solemn Strikes. So despite him playing a shitty ass deck that has nothing to do with anything, he still has Solemn Strikes. Like, alright, alright. Alright, and I guess that's game because I literally have nothing now. Like. Uh, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm like, wow. Like, wow. You ain't playing shit. Maybe I can reckless and draw into my battle fader? No. Alright. 
All right, so that's game. That's game. Wow. All right, so clearly this shit's not working. Like, wow, I, I got him off once, and I didn't even get to really use him before my opponent timed out. Like, it's fucking shit. Like, we're probably just going to go with the Saki version. Why just draw a whole bunch of cards and uh, actually use Yushin instead of Wild Monster Pierce? We'll probably go with that. Anyway, people, <coughs> let me go ahead and finish up. So he finally summons Denklaw. He banishes uh, his uh, one of his... Uh, Handsome Knight's uh, Bleed Boots to go ahead and get his sword. So, all I have was Forerunner on the field. Which, of course, if I went Forerunner attack, he could just activate his sword on Denklaw and uh, be stronger than me, right? So, I was like, alright, you know what? I sighted in Ghost Dogger. I was like, I can bait him, right? So, I draw, I do it alert, draw to banish one. He goes Dark, I mean, he goes Denklaw effect, because, you know, I had cards to, from my deck to my hand outside of my draw phase. I'm not Ghost Dogger. He's like, yep, you got it, scoop. And then, while we're sitting there on sighting, he's like, Wait a minute, you couldn't play Ghost Stugger because it had to be sent to the graveyard. Too late, you already scooped. <laughs> I mean, I still had to play because I drew into a Dark Destroyer, so I could have just went summon a ship, especially summon a Dark Destroyer, pop, you would have blocked your sword, doesn't matter, attack over your Dark Wall, attack you directly again, you know? So I still had it, but it was just kind of funny that, uh, you know, I did an illegal play and he kind of fell for it. So it's like, ah ha ha, trolly yoli yoli yoli. So I ended up tooling him. So now I'm 4 and 2. Uh, move on to the next round, I face. Drum roll, please. PK fire! Yeah! PK fire fucking five times in a row. Woo, it's exhausting. This guy, this guy, he was the biggest asshole of them all. This man, he was a dick. All right. So, uh, we, before we start the duel, he's like, cards an extra. I'm like, zero. And he's like, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm facing Monarchs. Oh, fuck. You know? So, we're doing plays. And he's like, you're playing Monarchs. Oh, shit. I'm like, I'm not playing Monarchs. He's like, oh, yeah, you're playing Monarchs because you have no extra deck. I'm like, no, I'm not playing Monarchs. So, this man, he goes off. He goes first. He's milling great. I think he busts out, like, Double Dante, Twin Twister, Psalm Strike, and Solemn Warning. Right? So, I go. He goes first. I'm like, alright, foolish. Send Dragon. Send all Dragon. Pop your, uh, pop one of the cards. I pop the Solemn Strike. And he's like, oh, you're playing Monarchs. I'm like, no, I'm not. So, I'm like, Summon Tin Can. He's like, Solemn Warning. He's like, oh, so, you know, so you're playing. So, he's like, so you made a shittier deck even shittier. Like, okay, okay. Sitting there talking this good shit. He's like, oh, I'm, oh, oh, I'm milling so good. Oh, I promise I'm not stacking. It's just so good. I'm so good. Like, okay, okay. Like, this man was, like, the biggest shit talker. Like, I'm, I was kind of wondering if I should, like, call over a judge and see, you know, what what would happen. I think he'd probably get a warning. But I was like, maybe should I milk, try to milk the game loss? Because this guy's being a straight asshole. So, uh, he pretty much opens up the tits, gets game, gets me game one. I set my back when he turns questions, proceeds to FTK me. All right? Uh, OTK me. Uh, game two... Game two was hella fucking funny. All right, I just mentioned that I'm running Stall Dragon. You saw the deck profile. Stall Dragon was in there, so because I can go Armageddon Knight, send Stall Dragon, pop the back row if I don't want to summon, uh, send Dark Shrine. I open up Stall Dragon, so I said, so it's Stall Dragon, uh, uh, emergency teleport, tin can, do all that shit, summon Forerunner, right? This man proceeds to do everything in his power, go off, use all the resources in hand to blast out F Zero. F zero attack my forerunner, take it. Forerunner attack my set monster. Flip up, dragon. Bounce your F zero. He loses a ton of resources and he proceeds to lose game two. Hilarious. So Jaw Dragon won me a fucking game, people. What? All right, going on to game three. Game three, he opens up the booty, mills the booty, gets nothing but the booty. I, I'm like, I'm like, all right. I think he has like he's floating on like Dante and Sir, and he has like some back row. I think he has like two back row with Dante and Sir. I'm like. Cosmo Joe, pop my, uh, I, I believe I had Dark Shore or or something, one of the big ships. Pop my ship, my ship, my bigger ships. Banish your Sir, so no Sir, gone. Summon Slip Rider, pop your back row. Draw. Cosmo Joe again, pop my ship, pop, banish your back row, summon Farm Girl, and proceed to FTK you. And I won. So I beat him 2 1. Keep in mind, this is the guy who said that I made a garbage ass deck even more garbage. Nigga, if I have a garbage ass deck and I beat you, then what did that make your deck? Like, God, he was salty. Like, you could see the look on his face. He was so salty. And it was so funny. When, I, when we called over Judge, my friend Kevin, who was judge at the time, uh, who's a judge, uh, came over and he was like, So I'm confirming that Daniel won? And we're like, Yes. And then, like, right behind the guy, you know, the guy wasn't paying attention. He's like, Yeah, yeah, good job, you know? So I was just like, Yep. So beat him. So now I am five and two. I just need one more win to get my invite to nationals. Uh, proceed to the final round, round eight, and uh, surprisingly, it is a Cosmo mirror match. My first Cosmo mirror match in the tournament. Uh, 
you know, we roll the dice, he goes ahead and goes first. He gets completely set up. Multiple Solomorn runnings, Twin Twist Bear, Cosmo Joes. He get he gets set up, called the hunted, all that. And I think I would have won the duel if I would have went first, but you know, he won the dice roll. I think he beat me by one. I think I rolled a six, he rolled a seven, he went first. So he had to beat me. Uh game two, uh aside in um system them. So he, uh, I go first, I go ahead and set up my plays, he goes first, and he busts out like two Dark Destroyers, right? I'm like, okay, system down, pay a thousand banish through shit, farm girl, and go off. You know, so I get game two. Uh, game three, I open up like shit. Like, I, I don't open up any of my side cards, I don't open up any of my rival, he opens up pretty well. And I, I try to stall, try to get the time, because he was playing a lot of life points, but he just out-resourced me, outplayed me, and in the end, I lost, so... And yeah, I went 5-3, I did not get my invite, I don't even think, I, and the guy who beat me, the Cosmo guy, I think that he got 20th, so I would've got 20th and got my invite to Nationals, because it's top 24 for Nationals, invite. And uh, once again, just a final duel, just like back uh, before in Utah Regionals with Tower Turbo, you know, I just eat a fat dick at the finish line. The last duel, I eat a fat dick when I'm gonna get my invite, and I lose, so, yep. Oh well, you know, I wasn't really trying anyway, if I was really trying, you know. There was a couple of times where Dweller would have been nice, a couple of times when Castell would have been nice, but overall, not having the extra deck didn't really fuck me. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call that uh, episode of Daily Duels. I mean, that's pretty much it. That's the whole tournament report, so. Uh, next Friday, I mean, we'll still stick with Zushin. Like, I'm not I'm not giving up. I mean, if, if I quit, you guys win. So we're doing Zushin. Uh, next month, we're just going to try, like, a, a draw deck. Like, Saki draw deck. I mean, you can't get any sackier than, than fucking Monarchs, right? So, we're just gonna play, draw, 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 summon a fucking level 1 normal monster, equip it with the Moon Mirror Shield, start putting Zushin counters, because you can go ahead and reveal multiple Zushin, so, instead of just doing, taking 10 turn, 10 of my turns, uh, I can only take, like, like 4, because Zushin, Zushin, and also, what you can do, is that you can go ahead and put Zushin back, and then redraw him, and if you do that, then you will... Um, be able to activate Zushin again. So I can go Zushin, counter, Zushin, counter, Zushin, counter, Magical Malice, shuffle my hand back, redraw. Oh, redraw my three Zushin, Zushin, counter, Zushin, counter, Zushin, counter. So we'll probably go ahead and try that version next week, next Friday. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this day of duels. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. So frustrating. Like, wow. Like, oh my god, I just wanted to summon fucking Zushin and do the fucking Neptune play, but fuck it. We'll actually do Zushin, not Neptune, Zushin. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and uh, yeah, see you guys next week with some more Daily Duels. Despite the shady decks on Daily Duels, we're not quitting, because if I quit, then you guys win, and I'm not losing. So, even if you get shitty duels like this, where it's a half an hour of me just trying to be sacky with Zushin and not getting off, hey, you guys are the ones that voted for it, so you guys get punished. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching.